Alright, so this is my first YouTube video to the channel. Um, my name is Michael, I'm in basic Michael Mulvey. Uh, I should be an A1C here in about a week, actually, if I graduate on time. Um, my FSC is Cyber Systems Operations, and I'm in tech school. So, this video is mainly going to be about like what is tech school life. You're going to see a lot of videos on YouTube probably about what tech school life is actually like. But the most problems I've actually run across is more or less like what you'll be doing specific to your job. And since I'm a uh, cyber systems, I can actually tell you what squadron you'll be in and kind of what the main things you... Alright, so cyber systems operations 3D032. Uh, you'll be going to Keesler Air Force Base in Biloxi, Mississippi. Uh, tech school is roughly four-ish months, depending on how long you feel like making it. And by that I mean if you fail anything, uh, you'll be here for longer. So... Don't do that. <laughs> um, I got here in September, and I should be leaving here next week, which is great. It's right before Christmas. Um, the only problem is the Sec Plus. Sec Plus is a certification you need for cyber systems operations. If you don't have it, you don't graduate tech school. Um, one of the things you can do prior that my recruiter didn't tell me about is you can take the test prior because it's a civilian test. Um, you can take it before you even join, get your certification. So when you go to tech school, you don't have to do this. You just go through your uh, two main blocks and then your four main blocks at your second school, and you can get out, go to your operational force, get to your, uh, your first duty station, you know, get in the game. Um, one thing I will recommend is if you want to stay at home, go guard. If you don't, go active. I'm active, and I actually got my home base. I didn't know what guard was. Because they don't really promote it, it's like the, they say it's the world's best kept secret. So, it really is, to be honest. Um, so, I got lucky enough that I am active and I'm going back home, which is really nice, like I said. Um, however, I do want to travel. I do want to go overseas, not necessarily deploy, but I want to go to like Japan or uh, Ramstein, Korea. Uh, just any of the, you know, cool places, that'd be awesome. And, mm -hmm, kick ass. Uh, anyway, for uh, cyber, and basically every single cyber job except for cyber transport, you're going to be in the 336 training squadron, Red Wolves, uh, like I said, at Keesler, and uh, you're just going to be training all day. Uh, you have PT Monday, Wednesday, Fridays, and then Tuesday and Thursdays you don't. And then there is a rumor that you'll hear going through BMT uh, that Keesler trains four days a week and it's true however it's four days a week every other week and the only reason is because we have civilian instructors uh we have, we have a lot of civilian instructors and it's to give them that extra day off so they're not called down fridays they're non-technical training fridays so we still do things like you're still in uniform you're still doing things you're just not in school learning your job um so besides that it all depends also when you get here, you'll do sleeves rolled up if you're here in the summer months. So I got here towards the end of summer, so I had my sleeves rolled up for like maybe a month and a half. Um, and then we went sleeves down. And then once you get towards the winter months, it gets like an awkward temperature. It fluctuates very much, uh, I've noticed. You go for, like today it was 72. Uh, yesterday it was 60. And the two days before that were high 40s, low 50s. And then tomorrow it's supposed to be 50 again, so it kind of it kind of jumps around and messes with your sinuses. It it doesn't feel good. Uh, one of my recommendations would be to buy buy one of these fleeces. Uh, you might get issued them at your first duty station. Um, make sure you check up on that. I won't, so I bought one. I already checked up, so I bought one instead. Um, besides that, if you guys do have any other questions, videos you guys want me to make, like I said, I'm 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 not new to YouTube. Um, I've done this before. But I made a new channel so I could restart uh, for all the military stuff. My other channels, I mean, it's not private. It's just when I was a lot younger and I looked stupid as hell. So I don't bother with that. Um, so besides that, like I said, I'm Aaron Basic Mulvey. Should be an A1C next week, actually, if I graduate from Sec Plus, which would be awesome. Um, it's called Slaying the Dragon. So if I can do that, that'd be amazing. All right, catch you guys later.